Despite the individuality of others and one's personal needs, there has always seemed to be an uneasy rally of words thrown about concerning a girl or woman's wants and needs and insecurities. On one half of the conversation, there are those encouraging us to smother diets, don't shave, don't wear mascara, don't conform in any way, and on the other half of the conversation, there are those advocating that all women and girls must be stick thin in order to be beautiful, must be completely hairless, and cake themselves in makeup each morning in order to be presentable. This is a confusing argument to many. I mean, what are we supposed to believe? And as the individuals, what kinds of ideas are we supposed to make of ourselves? Well, here's the deal. The only sound you have inside of you, the only thing close to a tangible voice, is the sound of the contraction of cardiac valves receiving and distributing blood to the body. So when I say listen to your heart, I don't mean linger on a whim of some overused quote, I mean believe in yourself. And I understand that there is nothing worse, there is nothing greater than hating every part of your existence, that there is no better satisfaction than gathering all of your insecurities into a convenient collection and analyzing them and advertising them to your interpretation as defective. There is no rage so abundant nor curious than the one devoted to your self-doubt to be told every controversial thing about your body that you've been told is a fuel to the fire. And you have been told a lot. You have been told, and maybe even believed, that you will only be acknowledged if your hips are wide enough. That each piece of your body should have been manually programmed to fit ideals. That self-worth is a scrimmage of physical appearance, you know. I bet the sky looks down into the reflection of the ocean and thinks I am ugly. Stop trying to stab the idea of beauty into every inch of your bare skin. Instead, safety pin it into your mind. Stop slipping breaths into your lungs and breathe from your gut. Take a chance on the personal archived instincts you have to live your life. If you don't want to eat that cookie, don't eat it. If wearing makeup makes you feel confident, wear it. If you hate shaving, don't do it. Believe in yourself. Until the sound of your feet follows the sound of your heartbeat and your voice runs like a warm river and pencils clack to ideas, there is nothing worse, there is nothing greater than feeling yourself break away from everything you've been told. The skin that winds around you is a tapestry. I encourage the voice inside of you to describe it. <laughs>